Well, good afternoon, folks. Matt Gill here from the Freak Squad and Jupiter IT Solutions. Today, I'd like to talk to you about the exciting subject of security software. Let me uh, tell you a little bit about my background. I, uh, I spent about seven years working for a local uh, antivirus and security company. Um, ran the operations department, uh, was responsible for getting antivirus products to consumers and to businesses. Um, started working really at ground zero in the industry as far as the intelligence that goes into you know, tracking down viruses and coming up with solutions for them, even helped design the products for a while there. So when I talk about the subject of antivirus and, and viruses and virus software, I'm not just a guy that cleans computers. I've actually worked at ground zero right there at the heart of the industry. So I, I have quite a bit of knowledge about the subject there. So I want to, uh, let me tell you a quick story. I had this a couple years ago, had a customer call me up and um, you know, she was just asking about getting some work done on our computer and she made a comment to me. She said, well, my other IT guy says I don't need to have antivirus on my computer. And my initial response was, what an idiot. How could somebody say something like that to somebody? That's just such an idiotic thing to say. But then I started thinking about it, and, and, and I realized a very interesting statistic here that we see, because we do virus removals day in and day out every day of the week. And an interesting statistic is 99.999% of the computers we work on that we clean viruses off of, they all have up-to-date antivirus software on them. Which kind of leads you to the nat you know, natural question, okay, well, what's the point if I have this software sitting on my machine and it's not protecting me? And that's a, that's a good point. I'm not quite there yet as far as ready to tell people, hey, don't run antivirus software. That would be irresponsible. So I'm not totally there, but I'm close. I have to be honest with you. So, um, you know, really just some great guidelines to go by when it comes to antivirus is less is more. The key is trying to find the, the most lightweight uh, products that don't have as much impact on the performance of your computer, but also ones that are still very effective there. Some of the products to stay away from are the free antivirus and security solutions that your internet service provider offers. If you're a Comcast customer, they're constantly pushing Norton Antivirus or Symantec, depending on which one to call it. It's the same company. Uh, their companies, uh, you know, try to endorse McAfee. Folks, these, these are probably two of the worst security products on the planet in terms of effectiveness and in terms of the drain that they put on your computer and just, just the noticeable slowdowns that you'll have. So generally what we recommend to folks, particularly for home users, because you can get antivirus for free, you can go to www.avg.com. They have a fantastic home virus protection that is absolutely free. It is probably the lightest weight and probably the most effective out of all the solutions there. And you know, Plan B for that, if you don't like AVG for some reason, um, there is Avast, that's A-V-A-S-T dot com. Also a great free home antivirus solution there. So folks, I hope this has been helpful for you today. Um, feel free to give us a call if you have any questions, and we'd be glad to help you out. Take care.